Hello, hello, hello! What's happening, everybody? MCOC Droid does back again with another video on Marvel Contest of Champions. Just a quick one for you today. Um, I'm still in the middle of my second Abyss Path, which has kind of turned into my third Abyss Path or a hybrid path. Anyway, that's another story for another time. Uh, I want to jump in here real quickly um, and talk about the compensation that just rolled in. Like I said, I'm still in the middle of the Abyss run, so I haven't even had a chance to start this summer Smackdown yet. Uh, I'll work on that this weekend, I think, so be on the lookout for some videos there. Haven't had a chance to watch others' content, but yeah. So I want to talk about the compensation that just came in, um, which they said we would be at least hearing about sometime at the end of this week. So I really thought, uh, especially once there's still some problems earlier this week as well, I thought it might get delayed. But here we are. It came in, and uh, it's pretty nice. It is very, very, very nice. Um, I mean, I can, I can nitpick a little bit and that's really just trying to find nitpicks. Um, I'll talk about that in a second, but, uh, again, in case you've been living under a rock and you're not sure what I'm talking about, um, I'm not going to read this whole thing, but here's their message here. Basically, you know, for the last couple of weeks and in the last week and a half in particular, it's been a rough time for the contest. Um, lots of emergency maintenance, the game crashing, um, issues with Alliance War matchmaking, just so many of those server related issues that pretty much has made, you know, a lot of modes of the game, not necessarily unplayable, but, uh, very inconsistent and ultimately very frustrating at times. So, um, they, they mentioned that there would be compensation once things appeared to be more stable, which it looks like they are. I mean, we're in the middle of, uh, an Alliance war right now. Of course, Alliance quest has been running. They, they slowly were bringing back the solo events, the Alliance events, things like that. So it looks like knock on wood, if you can hear that, um, things are running a lot better. Things are, are much more smooth now. So, uh, we were able to get this compensation, which again, if I really have to nitpick, I mean, let's go step by step. So I am Cavalier. Um, if you are uncollected, I think you get a slightly smaller version of this. I'm not sure about, um, anyone other than uncollected or Cavalier. So if you're proven conqueror or something like that, feel free to comment down in the comments below. Of course, uh, that's a good place to put them. Um, what your compensation package was, how is it different? Things like that. So 5,000 six star shards is huge. Um, plus a five-star Nexus crystal. I was really hoping that it wouldn't just be a five-star basic. If they were going to do a fully formed five-star, it would be a Nexus. So thank you a lot for that. Um, a lot of Alliance related revives and potions, of course, you know, in the, in the recent history past, whatever, you know, they've introduced these new Alliance quest revives and potions, Alliance war revives and potions. I actually have not bought a single one of them. I've stuck to items from the glory store and that's treated me well enough but uh it'll be nice to finally have some of these in my inventory as you can see right there um a lot of the alliance war boosts the specific boost so you see there's the two of the invulnerabilities two of the combat regens two of the advanced power boosts um two greater champion boosts which is great i mean i'm using them right now in the abyss and i'm going to continue to use them so that just gets back into the stash which is nice two of these alliance war boost crystals um which is really cool you know, certainly no complaints there. And then again, like I said, I'm in the middle of the Abyss run. So this is a huge boost right here. 15 of the level 5 potions, 5 level 2 revives. So that's pretty great. Uh, I mean, that's hundreds and hundreds of units worth of items right there alone. 5 energy refills, 250,000 gold, um, 5,000 glory, which is pretty nice. And then 45,000 loyalty. Um, you know, I mentioned if I want to look for nitpicks, you know, it even mentions in here, of course, um, if you look at the bottom of this first paragraph, we realize this affected summoners during a sensitive time regarding arenas as well as alliance events. Um, I, I don't know. I mean, yeah, the gold is there. The gold is there, and uh, it's great. That's a nice stack of gold. But I was kind of disappointed. There are no units. There are no uh, battle chips. That's the only thing I think really that's missing here. Um, but again, I, I'm just looking for things to complain about, not because I am seriously upset, but because that's literally the only criticism I can find. This is pretty dang good folks. But, uh, yeah, thank you for that. Kabam. Certainly appreciate it. hope things are running better over there. Hope things are uh, a lot smoother and a lot less stressful right now. Certainly appreciate all the communication, even with all of this stuff that's been happening. Um, and yeah, hopefully you all are able to catch your breath a bit, especially with everything that's going on, 
um, in the next month or two with all the stuff that they've announced. So I'm going to go ahead and claim it. Um, unfortunately, I don't have a six star to open. You know, I just did one the other day in prep for my Abyss run. Check that out if you haven't already. Um, so I'll be able to open one a lot sooner now, but I cannot open one right now, unfortunately. So the only thing I'm going to open here today is the Nexus. Um, yeah, look at that. That's so nice with those boost crystals. I'm going to save them for now. You know, we're towards the end of the season. Um, and of course, you know, I've I already had a few boosts in my inventory plus, which has got two of each. So I'm good for now. I'll save those. Um, I mean, really almost no complaints here, no matter what I pull, because this is a free five star and it's a free Nexus. So it's almost th three free five stars. I was trying to like not trip up saying that correctly, but uh, here we go. Here we go. Dropping it in the spinner. Something new or a first time awakening would be amazing. Let's see. What do we got? Uh, yeah really nothing nothing terribly exciting here um i mean i need mutant iso so i'm almost tempted to pick Sabretooth for that but uh i don't know i mean i don't really plan on using ebony maw for anything not even on defense so this is gonna sound weird and i don't know if if you disagree feel free to put that in the comments below as well i'm gonna take the free six star shards you know I feel like this is the best way to go. Just take a Max Sig Crystal because I don't really need any Mystic ISO. Um, yeah, I'm just going to go with that. I'm going to go for a Max Sig Crystal on Blade. So that is the guaranteed 275. And then uh, let's go open up that Max Sig Crystal. It's kind of disappointing. Um, very quickly as the conversation came out, I started seeing a lot of people with some very juicy polls over in my discord so congrats to all of you but uh i was hoping i would get at least a tiny bit of luck even if it was just like a new uh champ like a mordo or something like that you know nothing amazing but at least it would have been a new champ oh well i'm stalling long enough we'll spin this out for a second here um six star immortal iron fist of course would be a cool trophy champ any awakening gem would be fine, but uh, I'm assuming it will be, yes, indeed, the six star shards. So that'll wrap it up. Let me know what are your thoughts on the compensation. Do you think they gave enough? Do you think they gave too little? Um, feel free to put all that stuff down in the comments below. If you did get a five star nexus, how did you do? Did you get somebody new? Did you get a god tier poll? Feel free to drop all that in the comments below. Feel free to hit that like button, hit subscribe, ring that bell. All that stuff helps me out, and I greatly, greatly appreciate it. For now, though, thank you so much for watching. Take care, and I will see you next time.